So, the Yamaha Warrior got it tore down and found the head gasket blown. Uh, you can see how deteriorated it is. And if you're looking at the cylinder, uh, that gasket is just shot. Um, it just crumbled in pieces when I took the head off, cylinder off. So, that's where the oil was leaking from. Plus, there's an oil leak coming from the side cover gasket I found out right up under here it's leaking looks like somebody just put silicone on it well I got the new gasket for it and we're gonna put it together and they'll stop the oil leak plus on another note on the R6 we got the gas tank clean uh, the vinegar trick really worked out well. We was able to get, uh, I don't know if you can see in there. We was able to get it cleaned out. Uh, really hard to see in there. Let's see if we can get some light. Ugh. Got it cleaned out as much as I could with the vinegar. You can see there's some gas in there. I guess you can see the gas in there, but it's real clean at the bottom. Got a little staining, but it cleaned up real well, and it is ready to rock and roll now. Um, so we got that fixed up. In the meantime, we got another R6. It's a 2007 that's been wrecked. It's got bent forks on it, and all the plastic is just gone. So, I got to put the new forks on it, and uh, I think the owner is going to do the rest. So, if I do end up putting it together, I'll do a video on it. But it does still run, just has some road rash. So, anyway, so that's a quick video on the Yamaha Warrior, the 2002 uh, Yamaha R6 and the 2007 Yamaha R6 so just give you an update later